Hi everyone, Grey Power 60 here. So as I'm going through and organizing everything and, you know, having a little fun this week with straightening out my crafts and trying to do a few things, this whole week I've been um, just going around and going through my stuff and cleaning, cleaning up stuff I had. I'm going to show you here. Maybe I can zoom out a little bit. Uh, sorry, I gotta look. All right, um, this this clear container, it's one of the larger ones I got at, I think, Dollar Tree or Dollarama. Um, this was full of loose uh, stickers. Um, some that I had used and there was only one or two little pieces left on each. And I took the daunting task, oh my gosh, it was, it was crazy, of, um, I had these um, page protectors, so I tried to put like with like, but some, some didn't always go together, um, but I just wanted to package them, because the old packaging either was ripped or, you know, old, and you know when you use glue and your hands are dirty, Anyway, um, like, see, the none of these match, but I didn't want to, and I put some in the back and the front, just to have them a little better organized. And some of them are so old, and some of them are newer, but some of them are like, I've had these forever, and I think I got this at my old multi-craft clearance center. But here's another example of, I had like pieces left I'd used a lot. It came with that very thin paper and the packaging was all wrecked. Um, so what I what I did, oh, took me forever to go through everything. I got even my Canadian flags. I've had that for years. Um, and some of them I put in page protectors, especially the longer ones. And um, yeah, so I organized those, but that's not all of them. <laughs> Let me show you. I'll grab it, it's on the floor, sorry. I had this old binder and I, I had bought some page protectors and this thing is absolutely full. So I tried to keep all the alphas together but again, some of them were used, so I've only got a few. Some of them are still in packaging I haven't even used. Um, and I put them in these page protectors so that I could flip through, but I only have one binder, so that's why the other ones are still in the box. But I mean, some of these are so old. I've had these like forever. Um, and like I did with the box, I tried to um, put together pieces that were um, partially used, I guess we could say. Um, this is a good example, some partially used. I kind of shoved them all in here. These are dogs, these are cats, you know, and some of the, you know, even this one was sort of a whole mishmash of loose ones they're not they weren't loose they were on s small little pieces of acetate or whatever the packaging is and i just stuck it on there so now i i have this if i if i need any alphas or numbers they're in here i'm going to put it back on the floor get it out of the way so that was a you know that was a big job but in order to kind of get my place organized, in order to get my room organized, I really needed to I take a drink here. You know, each box, one thing at a time so that it's okay to, to organize your shelves and everything, but if you're not going through your stash to see what you have, what you don't have, and what's old, what's no longer any good, throw it away. Um, there was all kinds of tiny little pieces. I mean, I've even still got this strip. 
you know, should have put it in with the um, birthday stickers, which I probably still will do, but anyway. Yeah, so I'm showing you this bag of feathers. I th It was at Michael's, and they have kind of a clearance wall, and I don't know why they call it a clearance wall, because... If something is $10, they brought it down to eight. Like, come on, give me a break, you know? If it's old stock and you want to get rid of it, do half price or do, you know, something. This was regular $9 and I got it for five. And you know, they use the stickers, which really is annoying to me, super annoying. They use these bright stickers, but the uh, price you can't even see it. Like, I didn't even know if it was $15 or $5. I didn't know if that was $29 or, you know, like, you can't see it. I mean, even with the best of eyes, even with the magnifying glass. And if you, you know, if you can see that, I mean, that's amazing. Anyway, they had these feathers. And I did need a feather for something I was doing a couple of years ago. I don't remember when I got this. Um, anyway. But I've only used like two or three of them and I got this big gigantic bag full. So I started taking some out and packaging them. So I've got them packaged like this, but I'm never gonna use all of these, never. So I thought of Happy Mail, I thought, you know what? If someone would like to receive one of these, send me an email, my email address is always in the description. Send me an email with your address and I'd love to just mail it out to you. It would go nicely in a little card. And of course, you know, I'm gonna put these in a nice little card for you or something anyway. So if you're interested, let me know. Um, I see no point in selling something like this. I just think it's nicer to just send it off as a gift. So if you're looking for feathers to do a project like I did using it, um, you know, as a quill. If you'd like to receive one, please just send me an email. Let me know. I'm starting to package them all up. I mean, I'm going to keep some, but oh my God, like it'll take me forever, forever to use these up. And there's all different colors. You know, there's white and gray and browns and kind of butterscotch colors and different shades of brown, different shades of gray you know, and they're really cool, but, you know, when am I going to use that many feathers? But at the time, I needed a couple of feathers. It was $5 for the big pack bag, and I thought, mm, I'll use it someday. So that's what I'm doing today is I'm packaging a few up. So if anyone is interested in just uh, receiving a happy mail with some feathers, and if it's not too thick, if it's, you know goes in a regular letter I may throw in a little surprise something to go with it um if i remember <laughs> you never know what you're going to get from me i mean you're going to get what you what you've asked for but you never know what i what else i throw in the package so that is that and um speaking of happy mail and sending things out i have packaged up an envelope that has my um, pocket letter in that I had shown you, um, was it last week? Um, um, I have been so busy doing so many different things um, that I've forgotten. And I do apologize if anyone in the had commented on that video that they would love to receive my pocket letter. I am so sorry that I um, didn't go back and check it out and see. So I think a, a better idea, to be honest with you, is if you'd like to receive my pocket letter that I did, let me, it's not sealed, so let me pull it out in case there's some new people on here that would be interested. This is the pocket letter. And as I said, when we were talking about the pocket letter, um, I put a whole bunch of goodies in the back. I'm not going to show you. Let let it be a surprise. But there's some really nice things that I've sent to sent in here. You, um, I've taken off the dangle that was here and put it in a um, 
wrapped it in a baggie so that it doesn't get banged around or, squ or squashed. I hope it doesn't get, you know, squashed. So that you can finish it yourself if you want to put ribbon down the side, washi tape down the side, if you want to add lace, as I mentioned in my video. Um, and I have uh, a couple of, what else have I put in here? Yeah. Oh, I did add some feathers. Yep. I'm not going to tell you what else is in there because there are some other goodies in there. Take a drink. offer up some goodies for some happy mail. If you'd like to receive the feathers, send me an email. As I said, my email's in the description below. If you'd like to receive the, if there's more than one, I think it'll be just first come first serve. Um, I think it'll be easier for me rather than checking all the emails saying it's, you know, finished on Saturday. If you haven't emailed me by Saturday, um, you know, I won't do a group. It'll just be the first person that emails me that they would like to receive this uh, pocket letter. I would be glad to mail it out to you. Um, I'm sure, it, I'm sure it won't cost that much to send to the states. I, I'm, I'm not sure. I don't know. Um, I didn't take it in to get it weighed or anything, but it weighs almost nothing. You know, there's nothing in there that's heavy. I mean, feathers are not heavy. So now you know you're going to get a little surprise of a, a package of, of, of feathers. Maybe not a big one like this, but a small one. Yeah, that's it. So if you'd like to receive it, email me. Let me know. If you would like to receive, uh, be specific, please. If you'd like to receive a Happy Mail package of feathers, I can send that out to you. I have some addresses, but... I don't know if they're current um, because what I was going to do was just package these up and and mail them out to the addresses that I have. But I'd hate to send something out and not have the correct address. And I think I mentioned in my last, uh, last time I had suggested sending things out and getting addresses. Um, my A lot of my YouTube family um, addresses that you guys have shared with me. We've sent things back and forth. Um, those, those addresses were in my old computer. And when it crashed, I lost a lot of the addresses. I have maybe about four addresses right now that I can remember, maybe five, uh, of one of five of you subscribers that I have your addresses. And, um, so if if you want to if you want to receive either the pocket letter package or a package of feathers when you know I'm going to not just send feathers I'm always going to add a few little goodies I always do I don't know because I don't know how bulky this is going to be to mail but I'm sure it's going to go in a regular card size envelope I'm sure that'll be fine and I can even make my own envelopes I can make my own envelopes and um, mail those out. So send me an email to the email below. Um, I think it's 2016 Grey Power 60 at Gmail, if I'm not mistaken. But it's in the description below. Send me an email. Let me know if you'd like to receive either the pocket letter or the feathers and your address because I need your address. And like I say, the first one who, who sends me an email and wants to receive either of these things, either one of these, uh, first come, first serve, I'll just send it out to you. So, um, and as I said, I don't always just send one thing. You always get a little surprise from me. That's it for me. Thanks for joining me. Please give me a thumbs up if you like my videos and uh, subscribe if you haven't. I'd love for you to join our lovely family. I have some wonderful people. Uh, that have been with me for a long time and some really sweet newcomers. Thank you for joining the channel. I'm trying to get better as I'm getting more and more organized and experimenting more <laughs> and having fun with it, showing you things that, yeah, I make mistakes. Yeah, I have trouble with some things and other things. 
I love doing and it's fun. And, and we'll see you next week. Bye for now.